In iDirect, as, uh, as you probably know, we've got quite a lot going on at the moment. Uh, we've got a major release coming out in, imminently with, uh, with IDX 3.2.1, uh, which is a which is pretty, pretty major release for us. Uh, and then obviously we're bringing next year to market the new Velocity software, which is primarily built around, uh, uh, our, I suppose, our contract for uh, Inmarsat Global Express. So, you know, it's got some, some very exciting, um, I suppose, features and aspects to the, to the software and to the technology. Um, and in Dave's presentation yesterday, he just picked up on just one small element of that, but important, which relates to the network management system. So our new next generation network management system, which is you know, anticipated to take the company forward, certainly for, for at least the next 10 years. So Dave spoke about the new next generation uh, network management system, which we're bringing to market next year as part of the Velocity platform and will indeed be extending to the, the existing Evolution platform. Um, and, and that network management system will, I think, fundamentally change you know, the nature of IDRX business and certainly put it in a very good position for the next 10 years at least. Um, and a key, I suppose, a key aspect of, of what that next generation management system will bring is not just in terms of, I suppose, scalability, but the ability to, um, to, to deliver, I suppose, true, true roaming or true roaming capability. And what that means is an operator um, would be able to migrate or move vessels or move aircraft uh, from one network into another network, into a, into, a, uh, into a guest network, but still maintain the integrity of, of their customer relationships fundamentally. I suppose another aspect is that it potentially has the opportunity of opening up completely new business models that I think, you know, thus far really untapped for the satellite industry. Um, so, so that would be quite exciting. So, you know, I suppose with a very flexible architecture, flexible platform, the ability to roam from network to network, you could perceivably have, I suppose, something akin to the MVNO model where um, a telco or an operator could come in uh, to your network and effectively access capacity across a broad range of satellites irrespective of provider and just have one i suppose common portal in in which to uh, in which to uh, through which to do to do their business well i suppose that's the nature of nature of the industry the nature of the, the industry is constantly evolving uh, you know i've been in the satellite industry for 13 years it has changed phenomenally from the moment I first joined. And, and rather, I suppose, humorously, when I, when I joined, um, internet via satellite was dead. Okay, so um, in fact, the company I was working for at the time completely divested that business unit. Um, and then you see, you know, retrospectively over, the, over that 13 year period, the, 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 I suppose, the companies that have made um, significant revenue streams out of uh, internet delivery via satellite, iDirect, uh, obviously being one of those.